Namaste. I'm Rahul, a traditional yoga practitioner. Today, we're going to learn Pavan Muktasan Sri 1. This Sri is very effective for arthritis issue. Here, the first practice is a neck stretch. We're going to do in a four stretches. Look at me here. First, bring your right ear toward right shoulder. And feel the stretch to the left side of the neck. Hold position a bit longer. Breathe a couple of times here. Center. Now, left ear toward left shoulder. Feel the stretch to the right side of the neck. Breathe a couple of times. You're not doing fast movement. Simply giving nice deep stretch. Center. Like this, three to five rounds you should perform. Second practice. Second practice, bring chin in to the throat. Inhale, raise chin up. Bend the head back. Exhale, bring chin down. Inhale, raise chin up. Bend head back. While you're holding position, continue breathe and slowly chin down. This I show two rounds, but you should perform three to five rounds. Third practice chin toward right shoulder. Turn your head toward right. Bring chin toward right shoulder. Sit tall. Just turn your head. Keep your torso fixed. Breathe a couple of times. More center. Chin toward left shoulder. Nice stretch here. Breathe. And inhale more center. This also right to left, left to right, three to five times. This is the practice for the next stretches. Next practice is the shoulders and the elbows. Now take arms front, turn your palm the same up. Now gently bend in elbows and bring fingers to the shoulder. Now when you exhale, extend arms front. Inhale back. Exhale, extend. Two. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale. Exhale, four. Inhale. Exhale, five. And release. This we done right now five times, but you should do 10 to 20 times. Okay, next practice for the shoulder rotation. Bring your hand, right hand, fingers on the right shoulder, left hand, hold the right elbow. And rotate elbow in circle, front, one, two, try to get bigger circle with the elbow, three, four, five. Now opposite, five, four, three, two, one. This be done right now, five, but you should do around 10 to 20 times. Now other side, left, 
One, two, three, four, five. Opposite. Five, four, three, two, one. And released. Now same practice but keeping elbow sideways. Bring fingers again on the shoulder, elbow side. And circle it front. One, two, three, four, five. Opposite. Five, four, three, two, one and flat. So this all three rounds we did five times but we should do around 10 to 20 times. Next practice is for the wrist joint and the finger joints. In arthritis mostly this hurt a lot. So let's practice with left hand, hold right hand for arm. Keep your fingers front and the stretch and make the fist. When you make the fist, bring your right thumb inside and make the fist like this and spread. Again, make thumb, press nice fist and stretch two. Make fist. And stretch three. Make fist stretched four. Again, make fist, tight fist, and stretched five. Now same practice to other hand. Left thumb inside, make fist, tight fist, stretch one, two. Three, four, five, and relax. Now for the wrist joint. <laughs> Left hand hold right wrist. Keep your palm straight. And now just pull. Bend from the wrist. One, up and down. Two, three, four, five, other side, one, only doing from the wrist, two, three, four, five, wait there, next one, wait, make this, rotate, one, Two, three, four, five. Opposite. Five, four, three, two, one. Like this. Next practice is for the knee joint and the hip joint, as well as the ankle joint. So sit half of the chair. Take your right leg, fold right leg up and plus top of the foot on the left outer thigh. So left hand hold right foot, right hand hold right knee and do it up and down. One, two, three, four, five. When you practice, do it ten times. Release. Other side. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, but you should do ten times. Released. Now, next one. Next one is the hip rotation. So, again, take your right foot on the left of the thigh, right hand, hold right knee. Now, rotate your knee in a circle so you get nice hip 
rotation, hip joint rotation. So one, one, two, three, four, five. This was easier, but now opposite. One, two, three, four, five, and bring down. Other side. Okay, rotate in circle. One, two, three, four, five. Opposite. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, and release down. That's the second practice. Now, third one, sit end of the chair and take your both feet up. But if you are too stiff, if you cannot do, you can skip this position until your hips and pelvics get opened up. So hold feet, interlock finger and do the butterfly here, up and down. Around 10 to 20 times you can do up and down here. Also, other way is that bring hands on knee and try to push the knees up and down, more to the downward. So that gives you a nice stretch to the pelvis. And release. Focus on the knee joint and the ankle joint. So first practice is the ankle rotation. Take your left foot about right out of thigh. Now with right hand, hold the toes, grip nicely the foot, left hand hold the left knee and now focus on rotating the ankle joint in circle. So ankle rotation, one, two, three, four, five, opposite, five. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I have done five, but you should do ten to twenty. Then other side. Right hand, right knee, and left hand hold right foot, and rotate in circle. One, two, three, four, five. Opposite. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Bring down. Now for the knee joint, interlace fingers underneath your left leg thigh and lift leg a little bit up. Right foot firm, sit tall, and then extend leg front. One, and bring knee toward chest. One, like that. Stretched. Two, Toward chest, stretch three, tight your kneecap when you extend leg completely. Toward chest, stretched four, toward chest, stretched five, toward chest, and stretched. Make sure your kneecap tight when you extend the leg front and bring down. Then other side, interlace and pull it toward chest. Stretched one to a chest, stretch two to a chest, stretched three to a chest, stretched four to a chest, stretched five, and released. Okay, that was for the stretches extension for the knee joint. Now we're gonna do a little rotation for the knee joint. So sit tall, interlace fingers, so it will focus on the side and lift your foot up. Now rotate your foot in circle. One, two, three, four, five, opposite, five, four, three, 
two, one. All the exercise, I will just show the three to five rotation for the repetition, but you should do 10 to 20. So then you will get very good effect. Okay, circle, one, two, three, four, five, opposite, five, four, three, two, one, and released. Last two practices, focusing on the toes. So, very gently, I'm going to show you a bit side angle so you can see easily. Interlace fingers, extend leg front, flex foot toward you, and point. Again, flex, point two, flex, point three. Flex, point four. Flex, point five. Like this, and change to other side. Extend leg, point. Flex, point two. Flex, point three. Flex, point four. Flex, point, five, and release. Last one for the toes. Same way again, hold interlock fingers, extend. Now, your toes, press down, and spread. Press down, spread two, down, spread three. Down, spread four, down, spread five, change to other side, right, press toes down, together, spread one, down, spread two, down, spread three, down, spread four, down, spread five and relax so this is the practice for the all the joints we have done from head to toes daily practice uh, around one to two times morning one time and evening one time would be very effective for the arthritis thank you namaste